Good morning, guys. We are north of Dominican Republic, right there. Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening to everyone in the YouTube world. We're gonna enjoy this day. We're gonna ride the Bolt roller coaster. We're gonna have a coffee or so from Java Blue Cafe, and might do some other activities that do cost money so we can show you guys uh, another episode of what does cost money on the Carnival Celebration. So let's get started. Uh, I think we're gonna start with the coffee or the Bolt roller coaster. Okay, we have decided we're gonna do the Bolt first. That is $15 per person. The only roller coaster at sea. Come with me to the ultimate playground as we're gonna go on the Bolt roller coaster. Let's get on the ride. It is $15 per person. Should be fun. Here are the restrictions to be able to uh, ride the Bolt. No, you know, I got it. Bolts, ultimate sea coaster. Oh shoot. That's fun. Oh my gosh, that's a crazy, that's a crazy like transition right there. Oh my gosh, that's fast. Watch out, okay? We're gonna go. Look, 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 ready? Woo! Oh my gosh. Oh, that's so fun. Woo! That's scary. Look at that. That's scary. Oh my god. Woo! Look down, look down. Woo! Woo! <laughs> that's so good. Yeah, that's fun. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, really fun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The takeoff, yeah. Right there, yeah. One more time. One more time. One more time. One more. One more. There's nobody in line. Look, nobody in line. Wow. You guys survive? Yeah, yeah. Scary. Put it back on the other side. It's YouTube. Yeah, YouTube. So what do I do? You can scan it with your phone or you can look me up on YouTube if you want to see this video. Wow! I'll yeah, do I took that. a little video. Yeah, you want to do that for me? Let, Thank you. Let me put it here. Yeah. Yes. What's your name, buddy? Leo. 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 What's your name? I'm Donald. hanging with Leo. Yo, my name is Donald, Donald from Donald. Zimbabwe. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Really yes. cool guys, right? Five out of five. It was really five good. out of five. Everybody, this okay, is so good. Thank you. Yeah, appreciate you. Thank you. All right. Okay. Yeah, five out of five, it has a lot of pull, more than you think, because when you're down there, uh, looking at the ride from above, uh, I mean, it, it doesn't look that fast, but wow, it's faster than I thought. So I love it. Five out of five, you gotta try it. $15 per person, you take two rounds. And it's about, it was about a one minute ride in total. I saw the clock in front of me, about 55 seconds to one minute. Five, 55, yeah. Let me see. Uh... Oh, <laughs> good job. Yeah, I played yesterday a couple games, uh, beat some little kids, show them how it was. They weren't little, a lot of kids. <laughs> we are having such a fun time here at the Ultimate Playground on the Carnival Celebration. So next, uh, we're gonna do the ropes course. So that's gonna be fun. We did it once. It's actually a little more challenging and scary than you think. So it's worth your time. It is included, no cost. How do I decide if I wanna jump off the cliff right there? into the ocean. Oh, he's doing it. He is doing it. Oh, look at him do, look at him go. <laughs> he did it. Unfortunately, I couldn't have any body cameras, which I have my little Insta360. They didn't let me get it, so maybe next time I can try to sneak it in. But <laughs> I did do the uh, zip line over there. That was a little bit scary, I'm not gonna lie, but once my feet set off and it was just gliding through the air, we went over the ocean a little bit, it was fine. Uh, I liked it a lot. So again, uh, five out of five for the ropes course. It's, it's challenging, it's fun. So just have fun with it, don't get mad at anybody. Uh, take your time too, and you can go as many times as you want in the morning when it's not busy. Woo! 
Oh, that's so scary. Oh my gosh. Yep, that's what I did basically, but that's not me, that's somebody else. So, that was fun. You go over the ocean a little bit, that makes it like a little scary, but it's cool. So after walking and doing all the fun stuff at the, the ultimate playground, we are passing through the Lido Marketplace. It feels so good here, the AC is fantabulous. AC is amazing. <laughs> I got a burrito with chicken sausage. It's got jalapeno tortilla and Mexican eggs. So that's gonna be delicious. I got my favorite huevos rancheros. They're always a five out of five for me here at the Blue Iguana Cantina. It's just so delicious. So it's got beans, it's got the chicken. They make it so good. And um, you can have your eggs however you want it on top. I got I get mine over easy and get all the salsa and cheese. I just tried Leo's iced Americano and I, my advice would be do not get the Americano because the ice gets really watered down so bad. So I'm sorry. Yeah, I know. They're not a good choice for yeah. this one. But this one. This mochaccino is fabulous though and I think all, probably their espresso based shots are going to be good. So I would, I would say that one except for the Americano. Here on deck six, seven, and eight, you have the uh, celebration area. What's it called? Celebration Central. So my issue with Celebration Central is that there's a lot of crowds in the back of, you know, the seating area. So they're always coming in and out when there's a show going on over here. The theater is over here to my left. There's big windows and everything. That's fine. But I think when the crowds are over here on the right side, they're gonna just keep coming, there's lots of distractions, and you can't really focus on any show going over here on the stage. So, if it was more enclosed or a little more private, I think that would be essentially better. Got me a cute little banana bread that I've been eating. Um, anyways, I went through the uh, Lido Marketplace. Oh my gosh, there are lines everywhere. There's no tables available anywhere. Oh wow. Please do not eat anywhere around 11 a.m because you are gonna have a tough time. On a C day. On a C day, yeah, because everybody's here. You can't go anywhere else. <laughs> you gotta eat somewhere, so eat early. Uh, pretty much this episode is telling you, just do everything early. Even the boat, roller coaster, any activities, I mean, it has to be done early because everybody is rushing now to eat something. We're going to a trivia thing. It's called Big Wheelie Trivia. Don't know what it talks about. Well, let's figure this out. So you gotta take one of the paddle and a marker. Okay, we are... We might have to be there then. No science. <laughs> food? Easy! Easy food! <laughs> he doesn't know what it is. <laughs> He's like, what is that thing? <laughs> Oh, it's bean. Yeah, it's a bean. Like, some, some mashed bean. Yeah, yeah. mashed bean. Yeah. What they use it with to make it yeah, soft? The meat bread. Meat bread. Oh, oh, I see. You that, was know what it is. <laughs> that was a hard question. That was a hard question for him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, hey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah,
She's going to try this. In. Four fingers. Four fingers. On both sides. Both sides. Both sides. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna roll from the right to the center of the towel. We're gonna roll it tight. We're gonna roll it tight, 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 tight. Oh, okay. Okay. There you go. It looks like a sailor's hat. Oh, uh, yeah, I see it. There you go. You did it. That's great. That's great. That is the head of our animal. Yeah. That is the head. <laughs> good, good. You see? If you look at it, it has to have the shape like the ears. Might be a bird or something. The ears that is that, yeah. Delivery. Maybe a swan. Delivery. What is yes, that? Yes, I want the, I want the animal. It's no, no. And the animal is a bear. How did you see the bear oh, part? Yeah. Where is it? Look at you. That is I'm the bear. I'm confused. Where is the bear? Yeah. <laughs> well done. Well done. Like, well done. done. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. That's amazing. Good. That's so sad. Awesome, you have to right? fold it more. It's supposed to be like, like this. It's supposed to be like that. Beautiful. Level two now. It's supposed Level to be like that. And now it's Did you did it? Did you did it? Good. Uh, How about you? Whoa. No. Look at We're this, done. man. Grab the top. Grab the top. I think the it's the start good, of a good. monkey, if I had to yes. guess. All right, we're almost there. All right, so the best seller here at the Tropical here at the Midship in uh, Carnival Celebration is the Bahama Mama. It's got two types of rums in it, including a Malibu coconut rum, some grenadine, some hot pineapple, and orange juice. It is so refreshing. It's so perfect. It's perfect for being named as Tropical. <laughs> it's edible. An edible straw. I have never seen this on any cruise ship, let alone anywhere. It has sugar on it. And let's Oh wow. Lime flavored. Lime flavored. So you can eat the straw after you're done with your drink. <laughs> Tastes like paper. Bahama Mama. So we're still at the midship and we just finished the towel folding activity. I must admit, that was more fun than I thought it would have been. So I actually truly enjoyed it. Um, now, right now what they're doing in the same location is the bingo. So, you know, if you like to do bingo, this is an activity for you for sure. Their prices range from $29, $39, $49, and $59, I think. You know, obviously the more money you put in, the, ch the higher chances of winning. So right now, that's what everybody's doing and they're going to do that. Right, okay. No. What is going on guys? Here in a beautiful day, here in the, uh, the ocean, middle of nowhere. We're here on the 17th deck, but the second level of the Red Rock Bar, right over here. This is the only bar that has two levels in this whole cruise. So it's pretty cool, and it opens up to the main pool. As you can see, absolutely packed on a sea day. And what we got here is the most popular drink at the Red Bar, at the Red Rock, which is a Mai Tai. It's made out of rum. So it's got rum and lime and some other ingredients. $14.16 for this drink. So at the first time, we are here at the Alchemy Bar. I love the menu because this is really unique. Watch this. This kind of uh, light. Oh my gosh. Okay, cool. So we're going to always ask for the most popular drink at each bar. Right now, I'm about to do that. Cucumber Sunrise. Cucumber Sunrise. So it's got Belvedere vodka, and it's got some muddled cucumber, some watermelon, orange juice, and stuff like that. So let us try it. See if we enjoy it. Definitely taste the watermelon in this. Very fruity. Not too sweet. $16.52 for this drink at the Alchemy Bar. The priciest drink we've had so far, and it is the most popular here. Bar 820. This is on the eighth deck, midship. So let's check out the menu. I just ordered the flamingo. That is what I got there. It is 15.05 for this one drink, the flamingo. Cheers. La Havana pizza. 
It looks so good. I'm gonna put everything, okay? Okay, put everything. Literally. No problems here. This is included with your fare, so do not worry about any extra costs. We got a pizza called La Habana, and it actually has ham, chorizo, gouda cheese, mozzarella, and manchego cheese. Very skinny pizza, but it is actually very flavorful. We have now arrived to the Pig and Anchor bar. All right, brew house. So, we have chosen the most popular drink again, which is the Southern Peach. All right, so we're currently at the Pig and Anchor, and we are probably down to our last uh, drink so far, because I'm a little... Now, anyway, here it is, we're gonna try it. It costs $15.34. Uh, which includes the tip, so come here at Pig and Anchor. Supposed to be the perfect one. Look at that beautiful, beautiful sunset. Oh my gosh. Oh, so what's funny about tonight, it's elegant night, and uh, we are not elegant tonight. Obviously, you can tell. Look at this guys. So, if you want peace and quiet after a busy day or just having fun in the sun, come to Serenity. Doesn't matter what age you are. Kids can come here after, you know, the sun sets. So come here, enjoy like a bed like this, relax and watch the sunset, watch the views, watch the clouds, everything. It's beautiful here. Wow, look at Serenity, all nice and stuff. All serene. Oh, there's a 19th, yeah, the 19th deck. You gotta pay to go up there on that pool. That's for more like, uh, yeah, just for paid guests. They pay an extra fee to go up there. Love and marriage. Wow, everything's so red. Okay, well good morning, good afternoon, and good evening to everyone in the YouTube world. We are here on the second to last sea day. So tomorrow obviously is the last sea day. And uh, we're just gonna have a great time, hang out, and enjoy as much food as we can. So we'll catch you guys in the morning. See you guys. Why hello there, good morning. Well, do not go to guest services on the last day, because look what you get. We're gonna catch this beautiful sunset right there. It might rain on us for a little bit, but who cares? <laughs> 